Peggy 16. So welcome to the third uh, gameplay video of Final Fantasy Type-0 HD. Okay. My name is Dan, I'm a community manager at Square Enix Europe. And today I'm going to be showing you one of the new key features that's prominent in Final Fantasy Type-0 HD. This is um, a strategy element that comes into play when you are uh, attempting to, or when you, I, I suppose, need to, uh, reclaim land that has been lost to the military empire. So when you're trying to get yeah, regain territory back for the dominion of Rubrum. So you can see we've got troops coming out of uh, certain villages and towns that are located on the world map. And we're basically, we get to control them and we get to direct them to, to yeah, basically take over uh, or liberate, I should say. Our, um, our former territories. So yeah, let's take back our land, Kupo, for the Dominion. Let's do it. So this is the first first mission of its kind. So that's why we go through our tutorial so you guys can get to see everything of how it works. So this is Matiga. It's um, our base for this mission. And yeah, oh yeah, I should point out that we are playing, or I am playing, on PS4. Although the game will look identical on Xbox One, apart from the obvious button uh, prompt will changing with Xbox buttons rather than PlayStation buttons. So, you can see enemy troops coming out, or enemy infantry, I should say, coming out of Domain 1, who are blocking our troops from Matiga. So what we can do as Class Zero on the battlefield is we can take the... Oh, I say we can take him out. They just shot me in the face and knocked me to the ground. Let's, uh, let's be a little bit more tactical. That's the but way. yes, we can like hamper that. their advancements, making it easier for our troops to move forward and get close to their targets. So... going to be cheeky and just shoot them with fire magic as they come out. Oh, not draw too much attention. But there we go. So, when enemies, or I suppose when us, when we approach uh, infrastructure, some towns, buildings and whatnot, what have you, uh, they siege, they basically siege them. So, enemy troops, you can see from Domain 1, will stop coming out and it will be going to defensive mode and then our troops can circle it to capture it. Well, attack it, I should say, to capture it. Hooray! Dominion... Dominion? Domain one is under our control. And then when you approach them, you can regain lost MP. Oh! Seems something's going on. Now, our good friend Mog is giving us a special mission. Ah, okay, so, and as the, uh, the prompt explains that he can give us special assignments and we can get special rewards and special bonuses and whatnot by completing them on his mission. So I've got to take out this auto turret. So let's make quick work out of it with some handy thunder magic. Boom, get out of here. So yeah, now we fully command Domain 1. And because we fully command it, means we can deploy troops from it. There we go. So we've got two types of troops we can use, Blaze Units and Spark Units. So Blaze Units are good at capturing towns and villages, uh, settlements, I suppose you call them. And Spark Units are good at disabling machines. So since we're going to be taking over this town, Akvi. Let's okay, use some blaze unit. So you can see troops being deployed Good. and heading towards Akvi. 
And like, just like before, we can assist the troops against any troops that come out. Now, since this is a town, this is a little bit different. So it's got a protective shield, which sort of works, and it's the same mechanic as before, that when our troops surround it, they start to break it down and disable its shield. But once its shield is down, what we then have to do is we have to approach it and initiate an invasion, as this uh, prompt hopefully uh, this tells us about. So, let's do it. For the Dominion. So, all we have to do, I say all we have to do, what we have to do is take out all military soldiers in this town. And just like outside of town, Mog can give us special assignments as well. So, I think for this one, we have to stop the enemy commander from escaping, which he will do in four and a half minutes. Shouldn't be too prob much of a problem. We are the elite fighting force class zero after all. So, put your troop one down. Oh, there we go. Ah, oh, kill site. Lovely. So, Major Harriet, you're going down. Oh, okay. He's a little bit tougher than the others, but that's okay. Okay. Oh, so too soon. Ouch. Okay, so we've lost Rem, not a problem. Mackin will get the job done. Take that! So, Nimrod, let's make sure he comes down quick. Boom! There we go. So now that the General and the Magitak armor is down, we just have to take the stragglers out and this place is as good as ours. Oh, okay, so it looks like we lost Deuce as well. I should have been paying more attention to, uh, to my squad. That was my fault. So let's, uh, let's replace her with Queen. There we go. These guys don't stand a chance now. Ooh, missed. Ah, there we go. Got a kill site instead. I think I'll take that. Victory! Hooray! Get some Phantoma. And I don't think that was such a bad job. Two casualties, admittedly, but... But, you know, they... They lay down the lives for the greater good. So, now we have Akvi. Now let's deploy some more troops. Okay, we got two blaze units already, so let's send a spark unit and let's go straight to right, Corsi. Move out. Might as well go straight for the jugular. The Dominion has more momentum than I expected. Changing strategy. Oh, good thing decided to send out spark units because it seems like they're sending out Magitek armor. So the, the spark units will be able to stop them from coming out once they get to the town, but until then, it looks like I'm going to have to protect the base. The enemy so, any bit of thunder magic, take him out. So, let's get a little bit closer. Bang! No one messes with my town. Okay, so domain two is attacking domain one, but that's okay. They can fend for themselves. And we'll go okay, straight to Corsi. Or maybe not. We don't really have many troops out there anymore. So let's slow down Domain 2. Actually, slowing down it seems like, well, oh, they've been slowed down already. There we go. 
And there we go, the surrounded Corti, only a matter of time. So if we have a quick look on the menu, see where everyone's going, see what everyone's doing. Oh, maybe I sent those troops to the wrong place. Send them to Matiga instead of Corsi. Oh, but it's not to worry because we have plenty of troops. They're all ready. Took them too lightly. So yeah, there we go. They're taking down Domain 2. And oh, of course he's putting up quite a fight. But with reinforcements, it shouldn't take too long. Hooray, okay, so she was down. And we're going in. Class zero, commencing maneuver. Quick look at these chaps. Hey, where are you going? Sunny Jim? Going nowhere. Woo! Alright. Oh, okay, we don't need to worry about the barricade. Let's press on. Ah, oh, there we go. Kill site. Bang. My right, shock trooper. How about you? Oh, another one. Let's make it. Make it three for three. Ah, oh, no, I was too keen. Oh, he, he knocked me down. That wasn't very nice. Cheeky so and so. Ah, oh, I just got a range. Take my with phantom explosion. I don't know if Matthew has got range. Oh, he has. Nice. Wasn't sure. Lightning spell would reach up on the balcony. Oh, where are these guys coming from? Get out of here. On to the next area, the town square. And Lieutenant Hamilton. Sorry, the time is up. Alright, let's drill. Oh, okay, he's just let me, just let me turn. Okay, here we go. Massive amount of damage, I'll take that. Oh, I missed. Too slow. Alright. Oh, I missed it again. And here we go. This has got to finish him. Oh. There we go. That's it. And because we took out the lieutenant first, everyone else has surrendered. So, this. Talk to this chap. Ooh. Yummy. And that is how the strategy element in Final Fantasy Type-0 HD works. So thanks for watching. Hopefully this is uh, a nice little bit of insight to one of the new and unique things that's very different about Final Fantasy Type-0. And we've got another video coming up for you soon. So be sure to keep an eye out for it. I've been Dan, Community Manager at Square Enix Europe. Thanks for watching.